Step one on marrying clay is scoring. We're scratching the surface of the clay. Using a sharp pencil, I'm gonna go ahead and make some vertical lines, and then I'm gonna go back through and I'm gonna make some horizontal lines in kind of a grid pattern, okay? We want it to be pretty deep. Don't just barely scratch the surface. You wanna get in there and cause some clay to move around a little bit. Okay, and you're gonna do that on all three spots. And then you're gonna also score the pieces that you're adding. Okay, then step two is adding slip. Slip is watered down clay. It's all on your table. Each table has a little bin like this. And basically we take clay, we add water to it, and it's about the consistency of like yogurt. Okay, it can be like a milkshake as well, but not too much thinner than that. And you don't want it to be thick like cottage cheese. It's gonna take a little bit of this slip and you're gonna take it and you could attach it to either piece. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna go ahead and put it onto this one first. And I'm gonna put enough on each little spot so that when I set that foot on there, it'll ooze out a little bit. That way I know I have enough on and didn't put too little on. If it doesn't ooze out, you may have risked putting on too little and this will come off during firing. And the third step now that after we add the slip, third step is going ahead and sticking the piece on there. And when you stick it on there, you want to press it on pretty good. I'm bracing the bottom side with my finger underneath. And then just move it around just a little bit and try to pull it to make sure you have a good connection. Repeat that with all of them. Now we're at step four, which is smoothing. What I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna go around and clean out this XX slip that we don't need anymore. So you can just take your finger and kinda get this out. Otherwise it will get a little soft down there. Mixing with your clay, it's, at, it's like adding water basically. So we'll get all that off. And then I'm gonna go ahead and take this wood tool and I'm gonna pull clay from the foot down onto the pot. So I'm gonna take a tool like this and just take it and kind of pull downward over that seam. And again, this is the smoothing part of the 4S method. Step one was scoring. Step two was adding slip. Step three was sticking the piece on and now step four, I'm smoothing over the connection point. Okay, so after I'm done smoothing with the tool, I'll go back through with my finger and clean it up a little better than I had it before.